Hello everybody, what's going on? It's Ad Review for you here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Philips Wake Up Light. So before we actually get to the unboxing, I just want to take a quick look at the box here. On this side, just basically have some pictures of the alarm clock as well as some details in lots of different languages. On the front, it just says, Philips, wake up with light, feeling more refreshed. Two natural sounds or FM radio as you can see. And then up here it says, sunrise simulation wakes you up gradually, two natural sounds or FM radio, and bedside light with 10 settings. And then, as you can see, these are some different brightnesses for the actual light. On the other side, you just have some pictures, which I'm not too sure what those stand for. I'm guessing this is uh, for the sunrise alarm. This is maybe for the natural sounds. I'm not too sure what this is for, and this is for the bedside light. And right here it says, nine out of 10 consumers agree, wake up light works for me, <laughs> which is a nice little rhyme. On the other side, it's basically the same as the front, except in German. All right, so now we're ready to actually unbox this. One more thing I forgot to mention is on the top here. As you can see, it says, inspired by nature's sunrise, light gradually increases from 30 minutes before you set your wake up time, gently preparing your body to wake up. After your set wake up time, a natural sound will ensure you're awake. And then you just have some pictures of the uh, alarm clock. Uh, zero minutes, 15 minutes, and 30 minutes uh, while it starts its cycle. All right, now let's open this. So we're gonna go ahead and take the back off right here. This is one of those packages. All right, there we go. And open it up. All right, so we have a, a quick start guide, or a quick start card, as it's called right here. And this is basically just some information letting you know how to use this alarm clock. I'm gonna put that aside for now. So taking a look at the inside of the box here, obviously you have the alarm clock, you have a power cable, and then it looks like you have some instructions, some very lengthy instructions. <laughs> oh my goodness, these are very long. All right, uh, so we're gonna put those aside too, because I don't think we're gonna spend time reading those. Uh, you have one more piece of paper right here. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a two-year warranty. So that's what this is. So you have two years of warranty in case the alarm clock ever breaks. Let's go ahead and take out this uh, power cable right here. It's uh, in this little compartment right here, which is kind of nice. All right, there we go. There we have it. Phillips on the back here. Very nice, just standard cable. Has that little plug right there. I'm gonna put that aside as well, and now we'll get to the real star of the show, the actual alarm clock itself. So. Can we just take off the, okay, <laughs> I guess that works. Just take off the plastic and it looks like it actually goes through this uh, through this middle wall here. So we're gonna have to take this whole thing out, I guess. All right, that aside. And there we go, the alarm clock. I'm gonna take that out of there, put this aside. So there you have it, the Philips wake up light. On the front here you have a little circular panel and as you can see this is gonna be where the time is displayed. You have a couple buttons, a volume up and down, an FM button, a fast forward and back button, then you have a button which I'm guessing is for the bedside light, a plus and minus, as well as an alarm clock button. Now on the side here you have a button which I'm guessing is to change different display brightnesses, but uh, I guess we're just going to have to wait and see. And on the other side you have the uh, power right there, then you have a clock button which I'm not too sure what that does. And then you have a little switch right here, which I'm guessing is for toggling between the two natural sounds and the radio. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually plug this in so we can see what it looks like, and I'll be right back. So there you have it, the Philips Wake Up Light when it's turned on. Uh, now the button you guys probably want to see me press the most is that button right there, so that's exactly what I'll do. This is brightness mode 1, and I'm just going to cycle through all of them right here. As you can see, it's getting, it's getting really bright. Wow. All right. And 10. Whoa! And that's really bright. Uh, rest assured, the screen does not flicker like that. That's just a camera effect. So that's not something you should be worried about. Uh, but this is a one really bright light. Now, if this doesn't wake you up, I don't know what will. So this is definitely going to simulate that natural sunrise. All right, we're going to turn this off because it kind of hurts my eyes when I look at it. All right, there we go. Now it's nice and turning off nice and slowly. There we go. All right, now the last thing I want to test out is the speaker. All right, so now I went ahead and set a speaker for 1201. And as you can see, the light's already starting to turn on a bit, which is, I mean, it only has one minute to work with here, so it's not gonna work like it's supposed to. But uh, it's starting to turn on, which is a good sign. And I'm just gonna 
sit this down right here and let you listen to the sound it makes. I'm just going to put this right there and now we wait. So those were the two natural wake-up sounds that I just played for you right there. They're kind of relaxing, which I think may be a problem if you're trying to get up, because it might just put you back to sleep. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see, and uh, I'll tell you all about it in my review. Other than that, this is going to wrap up the unboxing of the Philips Wake Up Light. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to click the like button, leave a comment letting me know if there's anything else you want to see. And other than that, I will see you all in my next video. Bye.